Namaste. I'm Anne DePrado, owner of Raya's Yoga Studio. Welcome to our latest installment of Yoga Muse, Graceful Living on and Off the Mat. I'm joined here today by Alvin Kinzer. He's our new massage therapist, joining us at our uh, four-year anniversary party coming up on Saturday. He's going to be talking a little bit about his massage services, what he'll be offering. Um, but I'd like to take this opportunity to invite everyone to our four-year anniversary party on Saturday, which is coming up April 9th at 9 a.m. We'll start off with a live music and yoga class. It's a free class and the musician is Marty Walker. She's a wonderful, wonderful musician. In fact, she even played the music at my daughter's wedding last um, August. And the yoga instructor leading class for us will be uh, Leah Briggs, and you all know her from her daytime classes, and she's just recently um, taken over the Saturday class. We'll have a light breakfast afterwards, and also Alvin will be doing free chair massage so that you can get introduced to him. And we just want to take this time to offer this party as a way of thanking you for supporting us. We've been here for four years now, which um, has been a challenge in a lot of ways, but we're, we're glad that we're still here. And we want to take this time to um, thank you and honor you for being the wonderful community of yogis that you are and supporting our studio. So that um, brings me to a little something that we've been talking about in class recently, which is what it means to be a yogi and to practice yoga. And we've talked quite, quite a bit about the practice of yoga and the doing part of coming to the studio and practicing asana and breath work on the mat, but then also what it means to be a yogi off the mat. And what it means to me is that we are following our passion, that we are living our truest selves and serving humanity. Not only serving ourselves, but also serving the greater good of humanity. So I really look at each and every one of you as being a yogi. You're all following your path. You're all looking to make a better life for yourself, for your family, for your community. And that really is what being a yogi is about, is that awareness of self and that awareness of how we fit into the greater good and the greater society. So with that in mind, we really do provide classes, services that promote yoga as health and healing. So part of that is now having massage here incorporated into our studio. So Alvin, tell me a little bit about um, your services and what you're looking to do. Well, four years ago when we first started the studio, we were still looking for locations and we came upon this one. We walked through the space and we had this one room that we really didn't know what we were going to do with it or what was going to happen with this room. And I jokingly at the time said, well, you know, I should just go to massage school and we can make this a massage room. Well, four years later, that's where we're at. Um, we've had a massage uh, therapist working here at the studio before. I'm sure you guys all remember, or those of you who, who don't know, um, Christina Miranda actually started her practice here um, at our studio, and she's a fantastic massage therapist, but she's chosen to move on and pursue some, some other things in different directions, and so the, the room is kind of sat empty, and over the last year or so, Ann and I have bounced around the idea of my going back to massage school and, and getting my certification in that, and finally it's all come to fruition. So for those of you who've, who've endured, I guess I could say, the uh, free massages that I offered while I was in school, uh, hopefully it was a good experience for all of you and that you really enjoyed them and you can be my testimonies, if you will, to everybody else. But, uh, <laughs> but now that I've completed and officially starting my business, um, I'm looking forward to be, being a part of here at the studio. Um, Anne mentioned health and um, healing here at the studio and I really believe that massage is a big part of that or can play a big part in that. And so I'm really looking forward to integrating our massage um, practice into the yoga practice as well. So what I'll be doing is I'll be offering a couple different types of massage and as things get going with the business we'll be evolving and adding more things into it. So just to kind of initially start things off I'll be just offering two basic types of massages. A, a rejuvenating massage, uh, more just kind of a, 
a rest, restful, relaxing massage um, that some of you have already experienced, and then also a deep tissue massage. Both of those will be uh, 60 minutes long, and then also I'll be offering both of those as a 90-minute session. Um, as time progresses, I'll also be incorporating in on the deep tissue side of things more um, some tie table massage, some orthopedic massage, and then also some sports massage. On more of the just the restful re, uh, rejuvenating massage, what I'll be offering into that is not just a Swedish basic Swedish massage, but also some Ayurvedic massage, some hot stone, and some other things as well. So that's what I'm going to be offering at the beginning, at the start here. So, who's a yogi? <laughs> Following his passion? Yes, I would say so. Thank you, Alvin. Sure. And yeah, we look forward to having you as part of our yoga family here. You've always been part of our yoga family. <laughs> Whether you wanted me or not. <laughs> Namaste.